Father Lord, we lift be your jaw bell, we may not purchase you. Oh, just give me that spirit that I'm about to show my family members. Let's not be today that they start to be poor. Let's not be today that they might be poor from inside the family. Some grandma on TV or acting. Guess what we're gonna be doing? I'm sure you can see. I don't even have to be asking too many questions. Chef T A in the building. Okay, get up. Come on. <laughs> I have activated the chef in me. Father Lord, when it be your jaw belloni, Lord God Jesus, God, just give me that spirit as I'm about to show my family members. Let's not be today that it's fourth we were poor. Let's not be today that you might be poor inside the cup. God has said my prayers. Anyway, guys. <laughs> The essence of this video is just because I wanted to show you how I make it. Well, I wonder I'm carrying this back, carrying this back, carrying this back, sha. This was the very cute packaging that my snails came in. I'm going to be showing you how I make my pepper snail. And hey, Omega Leo, Chimo. Chimo, Chimo, okay, that's what I'm going to show you. So um, I got these snails from Snail Factory, which is an online store. I'll be putting their details in this video. And one thing I like about their snails is, okay, so this is the dry one. I've actually had it in the freezer for a while because I wanted to vlog before eating. And so there's the dry one and there's the uh, not dry one, shall you understand? <laughs> I'm going to show you how I make pepper snails with them. And one thing I like about the snail factory is actually the fact that the snails come ready. I hate that process of breaking shell, using alum or lemon to be washing, all those ones now long story. Anybody got time for, you know, modern wife? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I do it once in a while, but it's so stressful. Why would you go through all that stress when you have the snail factory to, you know, save you all that stress? And so these are their snails. They are already washed and they are clean, but you know, I like being extra. So I'm just going to wash them and, you know, show you how I make my pepper snail. Hey! Yeah, that is that. We are now into the chef industry. Come with me, guys. Let's do this. First things first, I'm going to be rinsing the snails from the snail factory. Bear in mind that these snails are clean and they have already been washed. So I'm just going to rinse them. I'm not making so much, so just about how many pieces. It's still a bit frozen. I'm going to boil them actually. I'll boil them after rinsing, just before I fry them and make them into the pepper snails. So I'm going to boil them for a while. But as much as possible, when you are boiling, you are not going to um, boil for too long so that it stays crunchy. Another thing I always like to advise people is to prep. Hey, we say everybody give them advice. Hey, <laughs> Chef T. <laughs> okay, so another thing I like to advise people is to prep before you. Um, before you start cooking so like i have all the ingredients like the tomato the pepper the onions the ginger the garlic everything is like all set so i'm just going to be pouring but you can only meal prep when you when you have time on your hands like if you have extra time actually because when you are rushing obviously you can't really have time to prep and do all of that before you start cooking so i've rinsed my snails um i'm going to rinse one more time i like Cleanness is next to godliness, but you can see that it's literally clean and it doesn't need much. So up next, I'm going to just be adding some water and then I'll put on the fire to boil. I'll put some water and then I'm going to put some onions. Let me slice some onions in so. And then I'm just going to throw one seasoning cube into it and I'm going to boil. Let's go. Very, very little. Can you me? Yep. Yeah, So I'm just going to cover it and leave it to boil. So just a quick rundown while the snail is boiling of the ingredients that you've been needed from the pepper. That you're gonna be needed for the pepper snails. Um, you have tomatoes and you have rodo, which is um scotch bonnet, and you have um onions, and I've actually already if mixed cheese, you know, safe a few to us now. We know I put in our house. 
I have onions. <laughs> Every Nigerian can relate to that. And then I have ginger because I always like ginger. So I'll be blending this, but it's going to be roughly blended. And don't forget that I have my snails from the snail factory. So up next, I actually want to um, add like some side to the snails. I don't just want to be chopping snails and chopping snails alone. So I'm going to be grilling. By God's grace, they're not gonna take fight. I'm gonna be grilling this plantain in the oven, so I'm just going to um, rinse them and put them in the oven. So quick one, I'm just checking up on the snails, they're still boiling, I'm just going to leave them for a few more minutes, like two minutes, and we're done. And so I'm just going to put this in the oven, okay. so I'm going to blend the pepper, and I'm just going to try not to blend it too much, so the tomatoes, the um, pepper, and the onion, I'm just going to put part of the ginger that I've blended in it. And blend. Remember, you're blending roughly. Then just add some water. Um, just a little bit. Yep. So, guys, my snails are ready. It's actually slightly cooked, just like I want it. And um, what I'm just going to do now is to take them off the fire. So, because I'm going to fry, fry for a while. The thing that I never even used to be a fan of snails. Fun fact, I actually hated snails since secondary school because there was a day that I ate snails and I threw up and I have this habit of <laughs> whenever I throw up, whatever it is that I eat on that day, I would hate it for life. But fortunately or unfortunately, picking grow, picking marry. Husband he like snailing. Wife, you begin to like snail back okay, because wife gotta cook the snail. Uh. <laughs> so, <laughs> yep, that's how it is. So, that's how I turn to a fan again. Um, so, yep, my snails are slightly cooked. I'm going to be putting this oil on the fire. You can see the ring lights. You see, it's not easy to be a vlog. <laughs> Anyway, I'm going to fry the snails for a bit before I turn them to peppered snails. Hey, my face is precious to me. Anyway, I'm just going to fry it for a while. Just so that it gets crunchy. I'm still frying the snails. Um, I'm just going to pour the blended pepper into this empty frying pan. I'm going to leave it till it dries on the fire. So I'm just going to let the water dry off. Remember, my snails are still being fried. So I'm waiting for the pepper to, for the water in the pepper to disappear. And also my my bowl is coming through. What do you think is ready? I mean, the aim is not to over fry it is just to um fry it for a bit so that it gets crunchy so i'm just going to pack it off the fire right now i know you all missed the chef's face so uh, i decided to show you my i thought you all the vloggers, they don't show you that part to where they are sneezing, they are crying, cutting onions, they, they will not show you that part. It's still boiling and it's almost dry. You poor good. The pepper is almost done. The shots, the water is literally dry. Sorry about the noise that you are hearing. I found it. <coughs> ah, I want to be a vlogger. I want to be a chef. I have put all the heat in I hope all the window me only work. Any sound that you hear, manage it like that because the pepper want to kill me. <coughs> I refuse to die. This episode will be complete in Jesus. Pepper um, is dry as you can see, and I just put it out of the pan because I prefer to fry my onions first. And so I'll be frying. 
So first things first is um, vegetable oil. Just going to put some oil. Up next, um, I'll be pouring onions. I love lots and lots and lots and lots of onions. Up next, I'll be throwing in um, ginger. I love ginger as well. So um, I'll be frying for a while. Ah, that is good. Oh, for me but I think it is um, ready to accommodate the pepper and so the pepper would be going in right about now up next I would be um, adding salt but not too much because I already seasoned my snails And then I would add seasoning. Look how yummy! Like all those chefs will say, look how yummy, yummy, yummy! The pepper is ready to accommodate its guests, which is our snails. Remember, we boiled and fried this previously. And so, at this juncture, you're just going to be staring because everything has to enter the snails very well. That was why God made it for us to shop it. Oh yeah, enter because I will shop you. Enter, enter. So the staring continues. You know, you gotta push it inside. Come on, do you enter this snail? I say enter job, but the latter is called pepper snails for a reason. Push it inside, guys. Our pepper snail is ready. I've turned down the heat just so that you know it soaks it all in. And I brought out one to taste. Will yeah. you get me the tester? Can you hear them? Mm, mm, mm. Can you hear? Can you hear? <laughs> it's so crunchy and yummy and... Oh, maybe you won't just say that. Ah, if nobody hype you, hype yourself. You know, now, nah, chef, they always get new things. <laughs> they always get some fine, 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 fine plates. So this one is actually a gift from my friend, Up This Catering. Thank you so much, baby girl. Hey, we are launching it on YouTube today. Come on. It's so cute. Thank you, my darling. God bless you. Hey, we have launched it. So she chef tea. Very cute. Yes. Yeah, let's have our snail. It's almost done. Just push. 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 <laughs> So guys, our pepper snail is ready and I'm just going to perfect. I'm just going to serve. I don't know why chefs always use very small plates. Anyway, that's what I'm going to be using as well. So, because that's how they do it. We have joined the association of chefs. And so, we're not going to serve too much because they know they serve plenty for inside plates. And I'm just going to wipe the edge with um, a serviette. What well, you see? Ready, so guys. That being said, our pepper snail and bully is ready. Come on, join me. Make pitch of this food. <laughs> Thank you very much, Snail Factory. The handles will also be in the description box so that you can, you know. With that, I think I deserve a round of applause. You know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, award winning pepper. Hey, y'all, I am. Yeah, guys. Like I said, let me know what you think in the comment section. I really want to read from you. Let me know if I should stop cooking for you or I should continue cooking for you. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm Toby Cat Daily. If you have not subscribed, I don't. What 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 else do you want? Cook, I cook. Dance, I dance. Laugh, I laugh with you guys. Oh yeah, subscribe. <laughs> I love you guys. Bye. Uh -uh. Do you know that they say there are germs on phones? Yeah, I my phone now. <laughs> what do you now do? I need my hand. Sorry.
I can always food normally. <laughs> no, you can't there. <laughs> no, you can't there. This is easy to, to prepare food. Mm, who made it? I made it now. Who you were sleeping? Uh, so you do not want to come and do dinner in bed? No, we only dinner in bed. So, 10 o'clock. Dinner on couch, Nick. Why are you sleeping? I've been waiting for you. It's waiting for you since. As you don't really wake up. I said this one is till tomorrow morning. Some sleep. Where? Some sleep. Uh, uh, uh. Can you sleep ever? Oh, my chest. You're such a waste. I need to start the diet too. With diet? After you've eaten pepper snails. But do you want to do that? Your mouth like be doing most. You think it's easy? Do you know when I've been making it? And I was filming that. So you were not useful. You don't even help me film or anything. I was sleeping. Yeah, and now you want to chop the reward. Oh. You almost like, though. You didn't see me, I was like, sorry when I'm coming. Like, for because dinner. Because what? Are you the one that married me? Like, four pieces. So I don't have to, like, eat bread or anything. Because when I don't see... Hey, man, do. Healthy food. Hey. And I opt for bread, rice. Hey. So I'm like breaking I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> my camera. <laughs> <laughs> you said, you made these two eyes, I don't look at me. 